vegetable. Hello there, and welcome to episode 36 of my series, where I try to play the cities, towns and urban areas of Norway perfectly on GeoGuessr. That is, trying to get a score of 25,000 points per map. Today we have made it to the coastal town of Rörvik. Rörvik sits in middle Norway, slap da smack on the shipping lanes between north and south. And uh, because of that, and proximity to fisheries in the oceans, Outside, it has emerged since the 1840s and 50s as an important fishing harbor, as well as a transportation hub and communications hub, with the radio stations, etc., for the fisheries and for shipping, and also as a harbor of staying overnight before crossing this particular bit of sea down here which is absolutely foul with shoals and scaries and uh, tiny islands and whatnots and there's been hundreds of people who have perished in this area uh, when th trying to go through in storms and uh, or get getting surprised by storms so Rødvik has been the natural stopover while we people have been waiting for the weather to clear Rødvik is these days the hub of fish farming, which is going on around the islands here in a, an absolutely gigantic scale. And it is one of the largest areas of, no or one of the most productive areas of Norway in fish farming. So Redwick is prospering these days. I have been here a gazillion times, it feels like, but even so, I'm only familiar with the immediate downtown area. It's not a large town by any means. There's like three and a half thousand people living there. And uh, as you can see, there's only 106 locations, but I think I will have ample opportunity to get lost. Let's see. So Rörvik means either uh, the bay next to a scree of pile of rocks, or it could also mean the bay on sort of a, a uh, um, high edge against the water. I don't really know which it would be, but it is an, a name of a farm that once was here before the town started growing. Now, I know what this is and think, yeah, so, <laughs> well, um, I said I've been here a gazillion times and, uh, well, that's handy in this case because we are, so, Rövik proper is over here, and then there's a little suburb on this island called Madøya, where there will probably be a lot of expansion of the town over the years to come due to the boom in the fish farming, which is just making this place explode with activity. So these days you see there's not that much of housing here, but there's quite a few businesses out here, and especially the fish farming ones. Now we are standing about here, I'd say. As we're looking, looks like looking absolutely well, slightly past the middle of that roundabout. So let's say that we're there. Yeah, let's go for that. Is there a stream here or a brook? Can't see it, but uh, well, there's probably one. Anyways, let's go with that. Four meters away. Good enough. This is downtown. Okay, they used. Is this where the old school used to be? There's been quite a lot of construction going on in the Rodrik in recent years, te tearing down old buildings, building new ones. No wonder if this is where the old school was. Hmm. Now let's see. Okay, so here's a cemetery. And yep, so we are looking down 
we are down this road here so this will be the cemetery the old cemetery even and here you can see that they have built new buildings here they have built uh, sporting facilities and uh, a high school thing as well um, we're looking at yeah why didn't i catch that on the first check lille got a small street a tiny street so we're looking um, let's see we're looking at that building no we're not looking north we are actually looking at just past the this corner of this building so we should be about there of course none of these buildings are showing because they have been erected since this picture was taken there we go now Rødvik has only been at, uh, has only had town status for two well three years no two and a half years so it's quite quite fresh and it's in a commune that actually has two towns which is quite rare for Norway and it's this one in Kolvred which will feature in a later episode now here's the town hall and that's uh, helpful let's see and uh, yeah so that way down to the sea and a fuel station down there I have been past this place a lot of times and here's the town hall and we're looking down this road at the moment actually if we move down here and then off to the right we come to the well the commercial center of the city well town let's call it a town it's not a city and um, which and uh, here we would find the site of the first civil uh first civil uh, fatal civil av aviation um accident in norway or air crash in norway in 1922 there were three people who were flying up the coast uh, in a uh, in an airplane sponsored by a tobacco company and uh, well flying uh, flying to promote the tobacco company of course and uh, aviation was still quite in its infancy in 1922 in norway and uh, so they were doing some show flying above the town when something went wrong and the plane crashed in the garden of one of the one of the houses between the ones you can see here and all three on board perished so that was the first civil civilian uh, air crash in Norway with fatalities anyways we are standing outside the the um, town hall here let's see looking east might not be the best direction let's look the west is dead so we have this house which must be I assume it's that one no it's actually that one and we're looking there ish now does that match no that doesn't match at all we are here let's go with that two meters away good and this let's see now we are here yeah, this is heading out of town and i believe this is this road the Hansvik road the well, question is how far up the Hansvik road are we so this is Bigiri. okay so that's a construction hardware store i don't know if that is still a current company though let's see oh here's Bigiri. right building material store that was a lot easier to say now okay so we got that house good which must be mm, yeah which must be which so we got that thing which is that but then there's something odd with the houses here there's something missing so not that house and there's that building and they are not really showing here are they not this one which is that one 
So either I've torn down these ones and built new. But anyways, we are just south of this thing, that little intersection. We can, of course, do a count down to that one, which must be this one. Well, we can do that. Let's see. Let's go straight west with this one. One. <laughs> yep, one. All of one. And then we look straight east on the other one and go one, two, three, four. So one and four is five. That's two and a half. And one is about where I put it originally anyway. So let's go with that. Two meters away. Cool. Final round. And I know what this is. Okay. So we're not quite downtown, but this is where the central area of Hedervik starts. So the new road. So drive this way and you'll eventually find yourself on the bridge over to the island where we started out and uh, we got some commercial districts and stuff over there and there's the farmers co-op for machines and stuff so we are currently sitting here I don't know if that thing is still there I doubt it let's try that five meters away and that is Rødvik done and in the bag well if I wasn't yabbing away as much as I was I could probably set a new record but eight minutes and eight and a half minutes is still all right with me and f for once we got some downtown locations like more than we got the, the outskirts once and that is something I'm quite happy about so yeah that is Rødvik in episode 36 done check in tomorrow for episode 37 until then, bye-bye.